Hey, this is Barry from 3D Printing Solutions in Houston, Texas. And today we're going to do a short video on cleaning the service station for the Z Printer 650. Uh, this should be done after each build because the service station is one of the most important parts of keeping your system clean and running. So first thing we'll start off with is placing some paper towels around the service station so that any water that we use doesn't get uh, dripped down into areas where there's loose powder and it could make it uh, get very hard. Uh, we place um, paper towel here and in the overflow bin. Uh, first thing we do is take the squirt bottle, take out the spit plate, use the water to loosen any powder that is uh, down in the service station wiping it off with a small brush. You can use a paint brush or one of these little acid brushes. You want to push any debris towards the drain hole which is in the bottom back corner. Make sure you clean up the sides. You also want to clean the squeegee. Make sure there's no loose powder on it. Check the squeegee to make sure it's not torn or damaged in any way. If it is, you can get a new one. All right. Next thing we'll want to do is clean the spit plate. Again, use a little distilled water. Clean that off. There's two tabs here. Lines up drops in. Make sure you clean up as you're going. Last thing you want to do is use the syringe. Get in here and clean the six little holes. Make sure that they're clear of powder. You do this last so that by flushing uh, the distilled water you don't get anything in there. Now if there was any powder in there that was hard to get out, you can use the pick, but use it very gently. You can also use it to clean up the sides and down around the bottom where it's tough to get in with a brush. Again, this is to be done every time you finish a build.